hello group members um, I reported yesterday that this engine stopped running and this morning decided to take a further look at it and this little hole here I've enlarged that slightly because it wasn't allowing the fuel to run correctly to the engine it was causing a vacuum so I've enlarged that very slightly I re-cleaned the little microscopic points which the autofocus won't fo focus in on and the other thing I did was I pulled the plug cap slightly off the plug because I discovered it was arcing past the porcelain without going through the contacts and hitting earth so that's what I did and lo and behold this morning she's uh, she's running again uh, but uh, those points are, are say, going to get replaced with a, a magnetic disc and a Hall effect sensor because they are just absolute rubbish. So delicate and so thin that um, they don't last five minutes. So that's what I'm going to do anyway. But uh, three things there stopping the engine running, as I say. If I was to push this plug cap right back on the plug, it arcs across. Um, and one way of, of alleviating that, which I found with the e gene engines, was to fit a dummy battery. So instead of the electronics running on 4.5 volt, they actually run on 3 volts. And it reduces the high tension and stops uh, bypass of the arc. So there we are, as I say, that, that hole there was enlarged very slightly, which was causing a vacuum. That plug cap, because it was arcing past the porcelain, and these little microscopic points, if it decides, the autofocus decides to focus it on them, they're not anyway. We're in a tremendous mess. So there we go, she's running again anyway for another five minutes before uh, doing an electronic conversion with each gene parts to make her run exactly as she should and be reliable. But there we go. Thank you for watching. Thanks everybody. Bye.